What up, Brother Anthony? Yeah. Well, here we are, Brother Billy. Um, well, I, I, you know, of course, or well, maybe you don't know, I mean, this, uh, when, when I talk about this, these dispatches, they go up on, uh, on the internet, you know. Mm -hmm. They go a bunch of places, but you know, they go on the internet through, uh, through YouTube. Then it gets like Google Plus, uh, but you know, it's modern stuff. I, I just you know, see what happens. But you know, we've been doing this since I think June this year, May, June. And uh, coming at the end of the year, I had a little bunch of leftovers up, put a lot up there. But this one we're doing right now, this is going to be for the beginning of the year. So, I'm gonna, uh, so I guess this is like a wrap up of the, the whole year. But I don't want to wrap up the whole year. I want to get the best of, you know, the ten best or the whatever best things or the nine worst or whatever like that. I want to talk about something. I want to talk about this coming year, this year that we're in right now. It's just going to be posted 2015. You know. You know, I, they always say, well, New Year, what, what, do you, what do you want for the new year? You know, what do you want the coming for the coming, you know, the next thing? And I've been thinking, I've been doing a little research, right? You know, you know we're, we're here sitting in South Africa. We're part of what's called the SADC nations. It's got like 15 or so nations. You go away from, from Madagascar, all the way, you know, to, to the west side of, of Southern Africa, you know, which includes the DRC. Democratic Republic of Congo, but the, guess what, you know, because look in here, let me just look at my book for a second, because, you know, we say the DRC, but, uh, you know, they've had a lot of names throughout the years. It, they started out as, uh, what did they, oh, the, <laughs> you know what, I, I should have looked and found out what the real name for the DRC was before anything happened, you know, but when the colonials came in, you know, the, the Leopold guy would cut off the hands and, you know, killed 10 million, come, you know, Africans in 10 years kind of thing, the whole, you know, African Holocaust, if you will. But the first, when, when, when uh, Leopold came there, uh, well, claimed the area, he, didn't, he never came to the Africa, you know, he just claimed this area and it's got all the riches, you know. It was the Congo Free State. It was important then, like the rubber, you know, rubber was the thing, without rubber. And the thing is, without rubber, they couldn't. You know, but this, they, they couldn't, and automobiles were just coming about, but a lot of things were just industrial were just coming about. But you, you couldn't run your automobile without rubber. No tires. <laughs> you see? So rubber was very important. But the world needed rubber, you know? And then it changed, I guess, the, the Belgian Congo, because Leopold that took it over, you know? And, and, and then they discovered some other stuff, you know? Uh, then you had the Republic of Congo. Now, around about this time, whatever, that, that, they discovered, like, I don't know, they got all kinds of, everything is in Congo, but you know, they discovered, what is it, uh, diamonds, and gold, or whatever have you. So now you got rubber, diamonds, gold, you know, everybody, now, hey, let's try to get this stuff, right? Then you have, uh, then, you, then you had the, the, the Republic of, uh, of Zaire. That's when they, you know, built up, you know, the uh, Seiko, you know, Seiko, whatever, the Seiko guy, you know. He came there. And then you have, then now you have the Democratic Republic of the Congo, DRC, you know. But what's the big thing now that they're trying to get out? Coltan. Coltan, you don't know what coal is. If you don't know what coltan is, well, you can't run yourself, or you can't run your computer. You need coltan to run your computer. You need coal, coltan, very important. The cell phone, you need coltan to run drones. You know the drones are going down and they're killing people in all kinds of countries, you know, they're shooting stuff. No coltan, no drones. So here's my idea. If you really want to sit here and be African, you know, and not a colonialist, control the coltan. Well, you don't control it right now. A bunch of, you know, mercenaries, geo, you know, people with interests, you know, all kinds of governments are controlling that. That's why you have the conflict in the DRC all the time. Every time they, something happens, they, every time they get a little break, they discover something precious and then they go in there and try to get it out, you know? And they don't control it, which is what economics is. Economics is basically your, your, your ecology. You control your own ecology. That's what economics is. The problem that we have with DRC and every place else is that we, the autochthonous people, the people of that place, don't control the ecology of their place, the minerals and resources of their place. They're controlled by someone else. And now they're controlled by someone else. They take it out and leave you with nothing. 
in a slave state. You would think if it's your ecology, if it's your wealth in that land, you're the first person that's supposed to get paid, not the person pulling it out or taking it someplace else. So what I'm trying to say, for the coming year, for 2050, but for the, for, the, for the coming, for the future, beyond 2015, gotta control your own ecology, your own economics, your own economics. You know, obviously we don't control our own politics because people are doing stupid things. And we just certainly don't control our own economics now. But that's what we need to do. Control our own economics. And all those things that are around economics, the banking and the, you know, the, 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 the bookkeeping, those are just things, you know, they're management tools. So that's, when I say control, I mean we need to manage our own resources in the, on our own area where we are, where we come to be. So that's it. That's the uh, beginning of something new, you know, beginning of 2015 dispatch. It's a dispatch from from, well, from the Austin Director Emeritus. That, that would be me, T, from the Patterson's Technical Training to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect. Yeah.